All right, cool. <laughs> Takes a little bit. <laughs> Mark Zuckerman, MassInSports.com. Sorry, Ron, you're not getting off that easy. <laughs> um, when Patrick gives up an early three run homer, uh, and maybe he's putting a little more, you know, guy, traffic on the bases than he's used to. Wh what did you see from him and how his night developed that he was able to get you into the seventh and, and keep it at those three runs? Um, I mean, you, you kind of just said it. Um, he was um, kind of nitpicking a little bit with some guys and um, we got to make some pitches, but he was able to get out of some big innings. I know that that three run early, which usually, you know, with the way we can, we can play, um, Usually, you know, try to make a comeback and stuff like that. He, uh, he, uh, he kept it going, and I mean, to go into the seventh inning, that's pretty impressive on his own. He kept us in the ball game. Um, at any point like that, where you give up a three-run early, you know, you can kind of lose your rhythm and, uh, you know, kind of go short. And um, he gave us a, a heck of an outing. Um, we wish we could have uh, picked him up. Like you said, when you give up an early three, you kind of feel like, okay, if we can hold it there, it's good. it will be mm -hmm. fine. It, is it surprising when you guys go through a night with just those two early homers from you and Trey and that there just wasn't anything else? Yeah, no, I mean, surprising is one way to put it. Uh, I think we uh, need to kind of um, bear down maybe on some of the bats all like, and, you know, try to, try to get, you know, one more run or, or just try to get the, the wheels moving a little bit. Alex Chappell, Masson TV. Jan, in the second inning, congratulations, you hit your 100th career Major League home run. Just to reach that milestone, 100 home runs, what does that mean to you? Um, it's kind of wild. Um, never, it was never a thing that I pictured happening. Um, it, was a, it was a grind to get there to do it. Um, got so many people to, that had a part in that. Um, thought it was never going to happen. I thought I could have. Guys joke around. I could have got an inside the park in uh, in in Baltimore, and when I pulled up on third, guys were making fun of me that they that could have been a homer. And uh, um, but I mean, it happened. Um, it was it was something that for sure I was definitely thinking about. But um, I'm glad it happened. I'm very, you know, proud to be uh, to reach that kind of milestone. Jessica Camarado, OE.com. Hey, Jan, congrats. When you said that. Um, your hundredth home run is something that you have been thinking about. Why is that? That I had been. Yeah. Why was it yeah. on your mind? Um, I think there's a little personal accomplishments that um, you go through in your career. Um, reaching uh, triple digits on homers. Uh, I knew it was coming close. I think last year I hit one and a guy robbed it. So, it was, you know, it was, I'm like, man, this is going to be a tough one. And then uh, I took, uh, quite a few games to, to hit my first one of the year. Um, but I, no, I mean, I think it's, um, it's a little um, personal milestone that I can, you know, I can take back. And I think just honestly, just getting to play this game has been an honor, but um, reaching a kind of milestone like that has been, uh, it's pretty cool. You have, you've been the hot topic of um, keeping certain baseballs. Are you going to get to keep that ball too? <laughs> I mean, you guys are not going to fight me for that one, right? I think I can keep that one on my own. Okay. I don't have it yet, so maybe they're going to do that to me. <laughs> Pretty drolly, the athletic. Hi, Jan. Um, so we've asked Davey and, and a few other people about what the big difference is with Tanner Rainey this year. I'm wondering, from your perspective, um, what's been the biggest difference with Tanner Rainey this year? Um, I don't think his stuff has been different. If anything, he's might be might be a tad bit down. I don't think he's hit a hundred or a hundred plus yet. But um, I think it's just confidence. Uh, the guy's got tremendous stuff, and I think he's learning that um, that he can just go out there and and blow the ball by people. And he's got a wipeout slider. And uh, the more and more he he gains his confidence, the more he realizes that he's an elite uh, bullpen guy. And you know we're going to be using him a lot in um, late inning situations. <laughs> 